kind of worried there for a moment that I couldn't get back from here. Agent Honor up by 60. Um, mission Knife because I can. Who put all this stuff in the way is my question. Because how are you supposed to go fishing with all this in the way? It seems really inconvenient. Who put this all in my way? I will kill you. I will be the one true R killer. Regular rod, regular bait, throw in. For some reason, right at the edge of shore. I'm not really sure why. I'm not good at whistling. <laughs> okay, who put it all the way at the right? You're a jerk. Also, I didn't hit A or anything, so it forced me to do that. So, I don't know what fish do. I haven't caught any fish yet. I wasn't trying to. I mean, maybe you can eat them? I don't know. Maybe you can sell them. I missed it. Dang it. Stupid phone. Texting me saying I need to go to the doctor. I don't need to go to the doctor. You need to go to the doctor. Man, I'm really unlucky, aren't I? Did it a moment too early. Okay, let's try again. <sighs> Hopefully, I get another fish soon.
Dang it. I think I should either get a better fishing rod or I should get better bait. I think that's my issue. But I'm too stubborn and I don't remember where to get those other things at. So for now, I'll keep trying to fish like this. I just need to remember right after the green tools one, there's the bullets. Once the bullets is there, that's when I press it. Not a second later or sooner. Gotcha. Determination. Polly Oxford. Got $400 for that. I'm done. We can see if there's anything at the other dock, but more than likely it's considered the same fishing spot. Or it can be locked and I have to go around and shoot it open. Because why wouldn't it be? Mm -mm. <laughs> Who designed a path that literally just ended in nothing? Who decided, like, I'm not going to connect that at the end? Why would I? Hmm. Maybe they were originally going to and then they decided to do something else with this, so they just left part of the path for some reason. Whatever. For now, we're running down here. So I don't ever have to deal with this again. Done. All of Miss Oxford's private possessions, you know, anything that she owns on this property that I don't like, I'm just going to destroy. All those barricades, pfft, who cares? Bait, which is always useful. Money, money. Why is this here? The boathouse isn't in use right now. Reminds me of the case where we had to chase the culprit on a boat. If only there was something like that in this game. That'd be awesome. Now, like I said, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the same fishing spot, technically. Yep. It's fine. Same fishing spot, so it doesn't matter. Now that I've wasted a couple hours in game, because it's almost one, <laughs> I wasted an hour and a half in game. Um. Do we have anything left to do here? I don't know the answer to that. I know I should go and do some side quests if there are any available at this point. I'm sure there are some at least. Grab this agent honor. I'm not dedicated to the story yet. I'm dedicated more to my own, I guess, wealth. So I'm kind of feeling just going doing a bunch of side quests, getting a bunch of cool stuff for it, because you do get some, you know, really cool stuff out there. One of the side quests I know we can do in a couple chapters is, like, just amazing for if you're ever lost. You can just get, like, it's pretty much fast travel. Uh, Story-wise, I've not progressed out, like, I went outside the hospital and that's it. I just went and got a bunch of stuff and uh, I was planning on doing some side quest stuff. 
That's what I'm doing, Cassie. So what I've learned is this, never, ever use the e-brake, there's just no reason to. I'm only a couple chapters into the first episode. I'm not very far in the game, Cass. I've gone to the hospital and done the things there and am supposed to go and talk to the twins and the grandfather. I'm doing a bunch of side stuff first. Um, where the heck? That's the a &G Diner. Keith's house, two suspects I haven't met, Heaven and Hell gas station, that's where I need to go. So I might be able to overpass where the Game Grumps are, but that's mainly because the Game Grumps aren't exactly the most adept at a lot of the games they play. Like, I love Danny and Aaron, they're, they're wonderful, great people who are just like kind-hearted souls. But they're not great at games. Like, they're even worse than I am, and that's saying something. Um, down here, I think. Oh, God. Did not... <laughs> like, why would somebody do that, Cass? I mean, at least they were raising money for charity, that's a good point, but $800,000? Hot damn! Okay, well, they're good at raising money. I wish I could be, you know, productive to society like that. Let's see. There's one suspect there. It's right there. Move out of my way. Why would he do that? Why would he write a smut fic of his co-workers? That's so weird to me. You from out of town? I ain't seen you here before. Jack the Raging Bull. I'm Francis Bull. York Morgan, FBI Special Agent. I'm investigating the death of Anna Graham. Do you have any info on Anna or any suspicious individuals? I ain't got nothing to tell the cops. What about the FBI? Shut up. At least give me your name. I'm Jack. They call me Raging Bull. That's a manly nickname. <laughs> shut it! If you're a customer, act like one and shut the mouth. Huh? Oh. Sweary65 just liked my tweet about streaming. Cool. I don't talk with customers. Whatever. Please don't spit on my car. Alright, let's, uh... Let's bribe him with some money. It's a hundred dollars, that's pocket change. Franklin you wanted. Give it to me. 
Benjamin Franklin. Let's, no, let's hear what he has to say, you know? Jack at Heaven and Hell Gas Station wants $100 bills. Hey, don't we all? However, if you give him more than $1,000, he'll supposedly give you some really big info. For the investigation, then... Hey there, Benjamin. I wanted to talk to you. Have you heard this yet? I'll tell you another one when I see you again. <laughs> okay, so I can go and play darts, and that could get me something cool. Zach, did you see that? It was as if we weren't here. I wonder what that was all about. Did it make sense to you? Oh, someone likes you. Also, because it's the best GIF ever at Death Stare. Um... Yeah, I just got 60 bucks. I mean, I spent $100 on that. I want to see if I... Probably can't, so I'm just going to drive in here and start doing the quest again. Depending on who comes out, that is. Oh, she came out this time. Cass? This is a character I don't know if you've met yet. Oh. I've never seen you here before. You in town to see some sights? Gina the Rose, Jack's wife. What's your name? I'm Gina. Folks call me the Rose. I'm Francis York Morgan, FBI Special Agent. I'm investigating the death of Anna Graham. FBI? Wow, how cool. And ooh, I like that scar. Do you have any info on Anna or any suspicious individuals? Ugh. I hate that complex stuff. Let's have a more simple conversation. Simple? Yeah. Do you want gas or not? Hmm. Uh huh. People really like my service. They like it when I put it in and then they like it when I pull it out. Do you like the way I pump it? Just thrust in there. Yeah. So, car wash. Let's get into the car wash. The car wash, yeah. Actually, while I'm here, I'm going to get some gas. Yeah, Cass, if you want... If you want, uh... Water and soap... You're going to have to, like, order from her ten times in a row. Not in a row, I guess, but... I agree with Crimson, though. She... that... those cannot be comfortable. Also, you can totally see her underwear in the front. Finish. Three times in a row. Cool. I do need to talk to Jack again eventually. Uh -huh. I need to bribe him some more. Let's 
skip that because we have already seen that a few times. Skip her walking back there because I do not care. Skip her walking up because apparently she's the only one here now. Wow, like five times in a row now? Six times in a row? This makes it your sixth time. <laughs> to thank you for being one of our best customers. Today, you get the special service. Have fun, Cass. Special service start. Here we go. <laughs> Ooh. Bubbles. <laughs> Washing cards is fun. Shiny. Mm, looks pretty. Up <laughs> there. She just washed herself and not the car at all. Ooh, <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Come again. I'll give you the special service every time from now on. See ya. All right. Zach, that was some aggressive car washing. She's crazy. Like a cat in heat. You may have liked it, but I never want to go through that again. Ha! Huh. Okay, special service, and I also got a lollipop for it. Because that's totally worth it. Now, Jack the Raging Bull, you're the one I'm looking for. Are you going to come out or not? You are! Thank you! Oh, that was actually really convenient. All six of her in a row? Like, okay. I like how the six times you have to do it costs less than one time of bribing him. Oh, okay, I can't do it right now, I guess. I guess you can't bribe him so soon. Zack, is there something here that you want to check out? Well, just do as you please. We can head to the forest later. Gina's Sponge. Hey, you guys want me to see do you want to see me do something incredibly like fucked up? Yeah. I'm a bad person. Ah. Uh. <coughs> type to me. There we go. <laughs> this video is going to be taken down by PETA now. Thank you, Cassie. Um... I have no idea where I'm going now. The milk barn is up there, and there are three things up there. So I think I'm going to grab the cards and then go to the milk barn. Oh, I think this is the uh, junkyard. Yeah, that's the junkyard. Cool. Everything just loads in in front of me. Wait, bone zone? What? 
Also, it keeps looking like you're trying to put a picture or something in the chat, and I don't know what you're doing. It, is that supposed to be an emoticon? Right. Forgot. Before I head in there... It's closed. Never mind. Yes, but Cassie, I don't know the context because I wasn't talking about any people or anything. I sneezed, said I was going to go get some like cards. I, I don't understand where that came from. That's not right. I'm not innocent, I'm just stupid. There's a difference, Crimson. The General Lysander. Cassie, I don't know, I, I, I don't, I don't understand, like, where did that even, <laughs> I understand what, why you thought of that, but just, what even, Cass? <laughs> Fucking memester. I think I forgot to go get a card. I think there were supposed to be three up there. Yeah, there's one right behind me. Oh, it's under the house symbol. That's why I didn't see it. Wait, is this George's house? Zach, we'll finish our chat later. Let's take a walk around here. I think this is supposed to be George's house. It is covered in red ivy. Yep, George Woodman. So it's confirmed that George is actually the killer? Because his house is covered in the thing that the killer uses? Got all the cards from around here, getting a lot of money, because money, 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 it's raining money! There we go. All straightened out. I am the most skilled driver, you have no idea. Hmm? Zach, we'll finish our chat later. Let's take a walk around here. And... See that there's a thing back here. Just curious why. Sure it's used for something later. For now... I'm going to head in the front door and start doing a side quest. <laughs> 